wanted. Cradle, used but unworn. Need a bow to accompany me to a friend's wedding. Willing to trade a leaky pot for a cart? <laughs> Writes these notices. Need a witcher? Any bloke willing to kill a monster, a witcher would do. Monster? What kind? Big, bad, ugly, squatch in the sewers. If you're interested, drop by the Garen estate. Ask for Olgierd von Everek. He's the one ordered this posted. Hi, oh, mate. Your mug's not familiar. What is it you want? Looking for Olgierd von Everek. Ah, that'll be inside. <laughs> Olgierd von Everick. I'm looking for him. None here by that name. Who are you? Who do we look like? A crew of cutthroats? Or a band of former soldiers who got lucky? That's where you err. Cause we're sons of nobles all. <laughs> and daughters. So, gonna tell me who you are, precisely? The Redanian Free Company. The wild ones, folk call us. Owing to the boar in our coat of arms. I was told I'd find old Geard von Everek here. Someone's made an ass of you, brother. <laughs> so maybe you can make up for that and help me, brother. Something tells me you and me have got different mams. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ungus, you've had your fun. I'm Ogeard. Tell me, what brings you here? No, no, I'm all geared. You? Not likely. I'm all geared. <laughs> You're all all geared. That it? Got it right at last. One man split into three bodies. Not interested in his balls. So which of you's got his brain? Not laughing. Guess that means you didn't get the brain. <laughs> nope. I'm the one got his fists. You're good. <laughs> You'd fit right in with our band of merry men. Come on, I'll take you to Old Geard. Ottoman, sir. You've a guest. Do you know what types of sculptures fetch the best prices? Statues of deities, busts of kings, and nudes. And what have we here? A naked wench. What do you think of her? I happen to like it. Especially the two ovoid forms. A jester. Good. I don't like men with no sense of humor. They bore me to death. Ooh. I used to like Votticelli. The life he could breathe into a chunk of cold stone. But I look at it now, and it seems just a rock, ideally proportioned, not a flaw on its surface. Painfully perfect. As lifeless and boring as a boulder at the roadside. <laughs> That's better. More interesting, at the least. Very well. And now to the matter at hand. Let's rejoin the company. Partake of some refreshment first. <laughs> 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 
Ataman all geared. Long may he live. Long live the Ataman. Long live the Ataman. Long live the Ataman. Come and drink with us. Well, we haven't a choice now. Fetch us some wine, dear. And a nibble or two. There's some special occasion, or just feel like feasting? Every occasion is special. Today we celebrate a dubby. Whose? Squire Herodor's new saber. I've hit on a name for her. Fair saber, I dub thee Traditiana. <laughs> Monster in the sewers. Know anything more? I've no clue what it is. Only that it's deadly. I'd not have bothered had my cook not become his victim. Ooh. The way she prepared game had no equal. That why she was in the sewers? To fetch game? Nay. She went to a fair with a sister or cousin, matters not. Daff wench convinced her a prince transformed into a toad lives in the oxen fert sewers. And you know, women, each craves a prince and will wade knee deep through shite to get him. Missy was no exception in that respect. Now she went, never to return. Wasn't the first, it seems, either. <laughs> hey! Leave her be! Is there any way to treat the Lord of the Manor's daughter? <laughs> Apologies. Now, where were we? Oh, yes, the contract. So, you'll check it. Just one formality to resolve first. My pay. Never you mind that. Return with the beast's head, and you'll have leave to take anything you wish from here. Awfully generous. Still, I'd prefer to agree a specific amount. Oh, fine. How much would you like? Three? Four hundred crowns? Four hundred and fifty. Agreed. And that'll be in addition to whatever memento you wish to take. Consider the beast gone. Confident. Bring me its head, and the reward shall be yours. Hey, you! Post papers! Name's Geralt. But I'm gonna call you Puss Papers. Is that a problem? Get to the point. Got an offer. Potentially lucrative puss peepers. Someone's killed me mate. Name was Clivert. You're to figure out who did it. Then cut the bugger's head off. Why not avenge him yourself? Seems like you all relish swinging your sabers. Aye, we do. And if I knew who'd axed Clivert, I'd have gutted him ages ago. Thing is, I don't. But you see a lot with them puss peepers. You'll track him down. I'm a witcher, not a manhunter. Kill an awful lot of them, though, don't you? When they deserve it. And my friend's murderer, he don't deserve it. At least hear me out. Clivert dealt Fistech. A few days past, he rode to Bowden to take a delivery. Never came back. Been there? Actually seen his corpse? No. But Clivert was one damned reliable orson. We was to meet. He didn't show. Can only mean he's dead. Find the bastard who did this. Find him and kill him. I'll pay top coin. Need to think it through. Clivert's got a scar on his forehead. Not unlike yours. Spot that, you'll know it's his body. Said I'd think about it. Know what, puss peeps? One look at a bloke and I know what he's made of. You'll do what I ask. I bet anything on it. Look for me in Oxenfurt, the Alchemy Inn on the main square. What's this? Order of the Flaming Rose have a new seat? Not too shabby. Yo, listen, Vagrant. Don't know why you're here, but take my advice. Go back to wherever you came from. So, why are you still standing there? I need to smash your plate in. Wondering what you got inside, because it reeks of fist tech to me. Mind if I have a look, brethren? Aye, we'd mind. Very much so. Enough of these games. 
I'm counting to three, and you're gonna be gone when I'm done. Got it? Got a better idea. You're all gonna count to a hundred. Got it? Three, four, five, six. Great start. Now step aside. Who the devil are you? I'm a witcher, or as your brethren prefer to call me, a mutant, a freak. You shouldn't be in here. And Knights of the Flaming Rose shouldn't be murdering humans or producing drugs. True, we shouldn't. We're supposed to defend the downtrodden. Spread faith in the eternal fire. But Radovid tricked us. He broke his oath, sent our brethren to the front as common grunts, and once the mighty order was bled dry, he disbanded us. Took our lands, confiscated our domains to finance his war. The brethren who didn't object were appointed mage hunters. Those who took umbrage dared to stand up to him. They were imprisoned or exiled. We're but a handful who still wear the colours. And we must find a new place in this world. So you turned rogue? That your idea? Wonder what Siegfried of Donnell would say. Siegfried of Donnell would... But how do you even? I know you. You're Geralt of Rivia, Jacques de Aldersburg's killer. None other. And if I had to go back, I'd do it again. That was the start of our downfall. You were the beginning. A cursed mutant, draw your blade! No need to yell, just ask politely. Avenged your friend. <laughs> I knew you'd succeed, puss peepers. I knew it. Go on, out with it, who was the bastard? Bastards, brethren of the Order of the Flaming Rose. What do you do to them? Scald them with hot irons, pick out their eyes, skin them alive. No, just kill them. Oh, so handsome and so boring. Here, puss peeps, your gold. Oh, no, you don't. Hear me? Don't you dare. Don't do this to me! Shani? Geralt? What are you doing here? I'm trying to save his life. Help me! Shani, calm down. He's dead. I'm sure something can be done. All for nothing. You did all you could. Thanks, Geralt. Redenian army force you to come here, too? Or are you just down here for a pleasant stroll? Got our orders this morning. I came down here with a whole unit, but something attacked us. What attacked you? Get a good look at it? No. I started running as soon as it appeared. It was huge. Spat venom and made these slurping sounds. That's all I know. Hmm. <laughs> Doesn't sound like a major necrophage or a pack of drowners. No. This was one thing. Big, but one. Somebody threw a torch at it. Monster couldn't have cared less. The soldier. He's someone important to you? His name was Nalls. Supposed to go on leave next week. Now he won't. Nor will the rest of his unit. How many were they? A whole squad. Six brave boys. All dead. Why'd they send you down here? Only if it's not confidential, of course. I need a venom sample from the beast that prowls these sewers. It doesn't just kill those who come down here, you know. The water in so many wells is contaminated. Folk are getting ill, Redanian soldiers among them. Plan to kill the beast. Bring you a sample of its venom after I do. Nice of you to offer. 
But I'd rather go with you. Collect the sample myself. Creature's dangerous. You saw what it can do. I'm a big girl, Geralt. I can take care of myself. And you know I'll get my way, so don't try and talk me out of anything. <sighs> Fine. Your choice. So show me where the monster attacked you. This way. Soldiers from your escort? Vern, Miklas, oh, poor boys. Beast doesn't play around, apparently. They saved my life. Know them well. Him, I met this morning. But Vern and I served together at the Battle of Dorian. Miklas only enlisted this Yule. Sorry. Once you kill this beast, we'll have to send someone down here to collect their bodies. Give them a proper burial. What exactly happened? We came in here and Miklas started looking for tracks. Then Drowners attacked. The men made quick work of them. But Franz was injured. His leg. He and I stayed behind. I tried to bandage him up while Nalls stood watch. Then that beast appeared. Nalls pushed me towards the exit and ran at the monster. I turned around and saw him lying there, covered in a sticky substance. I ran back to get him, then dragged him to where you found us. Where was the monster? Well, Miklas and Vern had driven it away from us. And paid dearly for it. Managed to get a look at what attacked you? Everything happened so fast. I didn't get a good look, no. Only saw it from behind. I know it was large and... slimy. Man you patched up, is he here? Franz? I don't see him. Think the monster might have dragged him off? Could have. Hmm. Beast probably crawled in or out through here. It's deep. Lower level of the sewers has been closed off for years. But Vern, the commander, had a skeleton key. See if I can't find it. Hideous creatures. You all right? Mm, fine. Look, it's bronze. What's left of him, you mean? What kind of beast would do that? Mm, a lot of flowers. Does that mean anything? Well, means our monster doesn't attack them. Hmm, interesting. What? Franz had a leg wound, right? Mm-hmm. Just above the knee. Managed to apply anything to it? Yes. Some spirit, but that was it. Why do you ask? Look, half of Franz's leg is gone. Monster must have chewed it off. Other bodies were untouched, except for the wounds they sustained in battle. Mm. Doubt we'll learn anything else here. We need to find the lair. This has to be the lair. Fresh and moist. Beast was just here. I'll collect my sample. Huh. All the tunnels and corridors converge here. What now? Need to lure the beast. How? We don't even know what kind of monster it is. But we do know it likes a blend of blood and liquor. Just so happens I've got some alcohol on me. Well, I hope you don't plan to cut yourself or... Relax. Plenty of bodies. I'll use one of them. Sample you collected enough? Hope so. But I'd still like to get some pure venom. Once you've killed the monster. To distill an antidote? No use for it once the beast's dead. Not true. I have a few poison patients on hand. Besides, I can study the venom, test it, maybe discover some interesting properties. I'll get to work. Hmm. I doubt I'd be much help in the fight, but you might need me afterwards. I'll look for a hiding place. You'd be better off waiting for me up top, or back home. But- No buts. Wait in the passage for now if you have to, though I'd rather you didn't. But when the monster shows, you run for the surface. Ugh, fine. Shani, look at me. Promise you'll stay out of it. I promise. Good. Now go hide. Be careful, Geralt.
Gadarash Isle Wood. 